So when you measure the distance from a point to a line, you want to measure the shortest distance, the perpendicular distance. Otherwise, if you try to measure from the point uh, to the line like this way, or this way, or over this way, you know, those are all going to be different distances. But there's only going to be one shortest distance from the point to the line, and that's going to be the perpendicular distance. So the way we're going to do this, this is very similar to when we found um, the perpendicular bisector. Okay, and I, sh I showed you about that in uh, one of the previous videos. Uh, but what we did is, you know, we um, drew a perpendicular um, and we bisected the, the segment. We're going to do something similar here. We're going to find the perpendicular from the point to the line. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to rotate this a little bit here. And I'm going to draw, I'm going to open the compass, okay, and what I'm going to do is I'm going to draw two arcs, okay. And if you want, you can make this one continuous arc, okay, or you can pick it up and you can make it two separate arcs. So you can either go like that or you can just make it one continuous arc, okay. So then what I'm going to do is I'm going to use this point of intersection and this point of intersection to draw two more arcs. So I'm going to rotate the diagram a little bit here so you can see it. And I'm going to use this point, and I'm going to use this point. Now you can change how open the compass is at this point. I'm just going to open it up a little bit, a little bit more, okay, and I'm going to make an arc like this. I'm going to go to the other point of intersection here, keeping that same setting on the compass. I'm going to make a second arc. And then what we're going to do is we're going to draw a line that goes through this point and this point. So let's go ahead and do that. Okay, now you can see, all right, that this is perpendicular. It's a 90 degree angle, okay? And if you look, this is actually going to be the perpendicular bisector of this segment from here to here. So we're just drawing the perpendicular from this point to this line, but in actuality this is bisecting this segment from here to here. So this is how you find uh, the shortest distance from a point to a line using constructions. Um, go ahead and review the video if you need to, and I'll see you in the next video.